Welcome back guys to another video and today we're going to show you how you can get your Binance API key so you can export that for tax purposes and use it in a portfolio management or tracking software like coin tracking. So first we have to go into Binance and log in. After that you have to go to your account and then all the way to the bottom is API management. Click that and you will be redirected to the API section website. Here you will see all your previous created APIs and if you want to create a new API on the right side you see create API. Now you have two options to generate API keys. One is the system generated and self generated which is a little bit more complicated. We're going to use the system generated one which is the default one. Click next. Now we have to label the API key. This labeling is only a name which you will see in Binance. So let's say coin tracking API. And then you can hit next. Once done, you will have to verify once by email and once by the authenticator app. So let's do that really quickly. Once you are verified with the email and the authenticator app, then you will get to your API management site. Here you can see the API key and the API key secret. Important to know about the API is that this allows to pull data from your account, like if there is only the enable reading option. If you enable other options, then you will allow with the API trading, moving funds, selling funds and all that. So make sure to know what you're doing with the API and with whom you're sharing this API. The best practices do not share your API secret with anyone. But if you have to do it like with your tax consultant, then enable only the reading option so he cannot move any funds and only read the data. So pull the data and then pull it into the coin tracking website, for example. So coin tracking will ask you for the API key and the API key secret in the settings option. And then with the only read only option, it pulls the data from Binance and inserts it in the portfolio management software. So once you have that done, you can copy your API key, key and the API key secret. And then for example, if you would like to use coin tracking, then you go to enter coins, API, Binance, and then you have here the settings API key, API secret. Then you confirm the Binance job and then it will start pulling the data. If you need more instructions about how to get the API key one more time, then we have a step-by-step -step guide on our coin tracking Binance API import site where you can follow along and then see everything for yourself one more time. It's very easy. We hope this video helped you to create your Binance API key and get the API key secret for your purposes, for example, for taxes. If there are any questions, leave them down below in the comments. Give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.